Hello everybody, my name is the Video Game Recon, and I want to do something a little bit different today. Uh, do not mind the ominous light uh, in the background over there. Uh, that is the crazy neighbor uh, who leaves that light on literally every fucking day. And I swear to God, that's like their murder basement. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different today. Um, so, I have discovered a book. Uh, it's a children's book, and I think you guys will appreciate this. Um, it's based off of one of my all-time favorite gaming series, and I would love to do uh, a series of it, but uh, it's God of War B is for boy. Now, <clears throat> I don't really have a deep voice like Kratos, so but I'm going to try and channel my inner uh, Kratos rage god monster, and I'm going to read to you B is for boy. Why? Because fuck it, why not? Let's see how this goes. God of War, B is for Boy, written by Andrea Robinson, original illustrations by Romania Tempest. Uh, I also want to say too, uh, before we begin, this is an actual uh, licensed product from Sony, which I think is fucking hilarious. And the artwork reminds me of those children's books that um, you would get, you know, like your parents would get you at like the age of like eight. And so we are alone now, just us two. No, I am not afraid of spending time with my son, are you? We will use this time for lessons, like A is for axe, steadfast and true, and B is for bow, which your mother made for you, and B is for boy, which means you. It's going to be a long trip. And isn't it beautiful? Like, oh, it's so beautiful. If you haven't guessed already, it's going to be your ABCs, but uh, for God of War. C is for come, boy. Control your anger. Close your heart. And do not touch that fallen troll. We do not know where it has been for a start. D is for dark, like the journey ahead. Wait, do not just run off. You will end up in trouble or dead. Beautiful pictures. And, of course, Atreus being the little shit that he is, getting himself in trouble and stabbing the fuck out of an already dead troll. Who was that man who attacked us? And since when are the Draugr so close to the house? And what was that frozen thing that attacked us? He is for energy. Yours is much greater than mine. We will play the quiet game until we reach the next shrine. F is for free with our business, which you certainly are. Do not tell this woman and a turtle I hate people. That is going too far. And of course you have Freya, reviving the mystical deer that uh, Atreus shot a arrow into. And who is she? Who is she to say I should tell you? I am a Giazan god. I do not need advice from my own son. Gods are bastards. Gods are whores. Gods are. It is not important. Moving on. And of course, it's an explicit. But I can only imagine that Kratos says whore. And there's the world serpent in the background. It's so beautiful. H is for her. The memory between us. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. It is not something I wish to discuss. I is for it will serve you serve you to stop talking. No, you cannot carry the ashes, boy. Keep walking. And of course, uh, the plot point of carrying Kratos' wife up to the tallest peak in the Nine Realms. For J is for journey, by now ours has surely lasted years. You say it is not even half over? Somehow, that is not how it feels. There it is, the highest peak in all of the Nine Realms, Jotunheim. K is for knife, do not lose it again. This is all you get, they do not grow on mountains. Nor does L is for Leviathan, commissioned by your mother. I take care of my axe by giving it to this hack and his brother. Of course, the lovely Dwarven brothers. Who I swear to God aren't even related, but somehow they are. Emma's from Mimir, smartest man brought low. Satire is full of unwanted advice as well. What does he know? N is for no. No, we will not go to the fool go on this fool's quest. We will not gather bones. You are are you listening, boy? Fine. Next time I mean it though. And of course, they're talking about the first technical side quest that you go on in the game. But uh, you know, there's a lot of other ones. O is for Odin, another petty god and his meddling progeny. I blame a cycle of bad parenting when it comes to Magni and Lodi, the sons of Thor. Uh, 
PS4 protect you from enemies from my past because the things I left out are too dark and too vast. And of course, we get to see Kratos doing Kratos things and slaughtering the gods of Olympus. Like that time he ripped off... Uh, I always forget his name. Uh, Apollo's legs? Beating the fuck out of Zeus and then stabbing him? Great times, great times. Q is for quiet, boy. This is spiraled quick. Yes, you are a god, but that is no excuse to be a dick. R is for responsibility over weapons and mind. You are powerful, but we must be better than all of humankind. And of course, when his... Every time. S is for start over, which I would like to do. There must be good gods to point out. I count, maybe two. Like T is for Tyr, god of war who fought for peace. U is for understand, this behavior must cease. And of course, throughout the game, you're following the guidelines of Tyr to figure out how to get to Jotunheim. Now we're getting into spoilers. Well, I mean, the game's been out for a few years, so I'm pretty sure we're out of that spoiler territory. For if V is for vengeance, nothing is down that path but doom. When all this is over, I'm going to lie down in a very dark room. W is what would your mother say? I would like to know. What did she teach you? How did she help you grow? And then, of course, I believe that is Freya mourning the death of her son. His name escapes me at the moment. All I know is that he was a fucking asshole. X is for that blank pa blank space she left, with no left, with no one left to fill. After we trudge to the top of this giant's hill, except for Y is for you, who makes me better and has on this journey with every letter. So your dad was Z for Zeus. That's convenient. And of course, that is the end of B is for boy. Now, you might be thinking, why I decided to do this? Well, like I said, I wanted something different, and I figured story time would be a, a great way to kind of spread my wings a little bit. Um, I don't know uh, if more books like this exist, but if they do, I definitely want to find them, uh, and I definitely want to read them in my own time. Uh, like I said, uh, God of War B is for Boy. Uh, I got this on Amazon for like 12 bucks. And honestly, I mean, 12 bucks is a little steep, but I mean, it's a nice little read. It's it's cute. It's adorable. And it's one of those things where, like I said, it looks like a children's book. So why the fuck not? Pick this up, read it to your child before bed. I'm sure they'd appreciate it, especially all the nice, colorful, bloody artwork. Oh, it's perfect for little boys and girls and children of all ages. So anyway, guys. That has been story time, and like, oh shit, I punched my microphone. That's going to sound great in the end. Uh, but anyway, guys, like I said, that has been story time. I hope you enjoyed, and if you guys want more, let me know. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.